Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to... Where's the button? There's the button. Dark Souls Remastered. Okay, so... Let me just make sure my recording is going fine. <laughs> right off the bat. Make sure we're recording. That's a good start. Okay, right. Uh, forgive me if my camera looks worse or darker or whatever. Um, it's a very, very hot day today, so I've got my hair out of my face. Um... And I haven't got my hot studio light turned on, so I'm a bit dark and the camera's looking shitter than usual. But it is what it is. Okay, so I'm continuing straight off from the last part. In terms of position, it's been a few days. I haven't done anything in between episodes for once. Um, I reloaded the game and I didn't go anywhere, but I saw that there was something in front of me that was not there before. So I stopped still on the spot in case something happened and I didn't move and now start the episode. So, uh, no idea what to expect. Um, I'm going to kindle this bonfire, I've decided, because, I don't know, this whole town that people in the comments have been calling Township uh, seems like a big deal. So I'll be kindling the shit out of this fire. But since this person over here wasn't here when I ended the last episode, I'm terrified they're going to vanish if I rest at the fire again, so... Let's just say hello. At first I thought it was bluish colour, so I thought it was the body of Artorias, but it's not. Hello? Is that grave supposed to be Artorias' grave? Hello? You. Is that not the soul of the man who fell on this spot? He was a dear friend. I wish to pay proper respect with that soul. Would you oh. be willing to part with it? Artorius' soul. Okay. I did th I did wonder if that would be used to make a boss weapon back at the giant blacksmith, but it's it seems to have a special purpose. Who is this person? I'm trying to get a good look. They've got like a, f a face mask on, which which reminds me of Pinwheel's face masks. Strange. But she's wearing blue just like Artorias. Okay. Fuck it, why not? Thank you. Thank you. You are very kind. You're welcome. Please take this. I no longer need it. Dark Silver Tracer Gold Tracer. <laughs> well, thank you very much. There you go, I don't even need to turn it into a boss weapon. Okay. Lord guide thee. Thank you. You're very kind. Let's see. Let's give those a good read. Um, Gold Tracer is a slash curved sword. I've already got um, my Fury Sword, but oh, oh, A Dex and E Strength for not upgraded. That's not bad at all, dude. That's actually excellent. Um. Curved sword used by the Lord's Blade. So yeah, I should point out before we do anything, we're just going to continue. That's what our game plan is this episode. Keep going down into the town. De we're going downtown. Uh, and then, who knows, maybe we'll even end the game this episode. Um, I've just, yeah, since editing the last episode, I realized that that red dragon might be back on the bridge if I had if I had had a loading screen, if you see what I'm saying, rather than just rested at a fire. So I will be going to that bridge before the end of the game to see if we can kill that damn dragon. Um, but I'm not too... Well, I do want to fight him and kill him. But I'm not too precious about it if he keeps flying away. Anyway, yeah, sorry. Curved sword used by the Lord's Blade, Ciaran. The Lord's Blade... One of Lord Gwyn's four knights. Artorius is one of the four knights, I know that for a fact. So who are these four knights? I, I should have probably written the names down. We know that Artorius was one of them. Um, and people were telling me how strong Artorius really is. Like, he he lost the use of his dominant hand. And this enti that entire fight that just happened, he was using... Apparently he gave his shield to the Great Wolf Sif, his, like, pet slash guardian slash whatever, um, to protect the the wolf. So he was left with just his sword, apparently got gravely injured with his dominant hand, so he couldn't use his dominant hand, 
Um, so we fought like a greatly weakened version of him, and he was like off-handing just a sword. So people rightly commented how strong he must be, like at full strength. I still think that's standard shots. Anyway, Ciaran branches her sword in a mesmerizing dance. Is this Ciaran? Because this this is a her. Um. Hmm. Let if if I should already know. Please let me know who the four knights are. We've got Artorius and now Ciaran. Brandish is her sword in a mesmerizing dance, etching the darkness with dire streaks of gold. Well, she gave me this sword. So this must be Ciaran. So this is, hang on, is this one of the four knights? She is wearing the same garb as Artorius, the blue garb. Although hers looks much, you can't look. Hers looks much nicer than, uh, than Artorius's like fallen abyss fucked garb. But even the armor is similar actually. It's not just the blue, it's the armor. Must be. Okay. Where's the other sword? I might level up a crystal sword by the way. Like to maximum if I can before the end of the game because apparently Upgrading them fully repairs them, and it's a way of keeping them alive for much, much longer. Uh, anyway, Dark Silver Tracer. Oh, this is a dagger with some thrust. S! S! That's the first S scaling I've seen in this game. Bruh. Okay. Okay, a Dark Silver Dagger used by the Lord's Blade, Ciaran. Char- Charon? Ciaran? Ciaran? Oh, no. It looks Italian. I'm going to say Charon of Gwyn's Four Knights. So she had two different weapons. The victim is first distracted by dazzling streaks of the gold tracer. Ah, so she dual wielded. Canonically, she dual wielded. That's cool. So she she dazzled with the goldie boy and then she stabbed, stung with the vicious poison of that one. That's cool. Well, hang on a second. If I'd have... I'm fully aware at this point that the vast majority, pretty much all NPCs, not counting big snaky boy, you can fight and kill. If I'd have actually slashed her with a sword, would I, would I have been able to fight her and get her two weapons and see those two weapons in action? May the Lord guide. I'm not going to do that this playthrough. In my opinion, uh, f let me know if you feel differently, but in your first blind playthrough, I I'm not... Uh, I'm not wanting to just kill NPCs. That's that's very much like a repeated playthrough thing to do. I'm not just going to kill her. She's been friendly and kind to me. I'm not going to just fight her. But I'm curious if she would be as tough as Artorius. Like with a full proper boss health bar and everything. May the Lord... Oh my god, I definitely need to uh, do a replay of this. May the... I'll tell you what, I have, I've been saying this repeatedly about playing these games again. It's going to be a while, but once I do 2 and 3 and whatever other games are on PC, because I don't have access to a PlayStation, I definitely feel like I'm going to do replays of these games. Probably in live streams, because I can get through the games much, much, much faster that way. But, um, but yeah, I've got to do replays. And since I do magic, uh, I'm just going to check this whole area again. Forgive me, just in case I've missed something before we head down to the town. Yeah, some people have been asking me to do like, maybe like magic builds or whatever. Um, and since I tend to lean melee, um, just, I just like swords and things, you know what I mean? And just like killing NPCs, I kind of feel like, unless you're comfortable with magic builds, that's very much like a replay sort of a build to use. Um, I prefer to learn the meat and potatoes of a game just by with, with a basic melee build, honestly. But maybe in all the replays of them in the future, maybe I can do magic builds. I did have uh, one guy ask me to do try a magic build, or like a magic hybrid build in Dark Souls 2, the very next game, which I'll probably be starting within a week or two. Um, and I have been tempted. In fact, let me know if you want me to do a purely magic build in Dark Souls 2. 
I've heard Dark Souls 2 is vastly different, like, compared to all the other FromSoft games in terms of dodging and, like, weirdness like that. I've heard it's it's just, like, very different, and it's why a lot of people don't like Dark Souls 2. But I don't know how that ties into doing a magic build versus your regular melee build. Because if it helps to be at, to stay at long range and cast spells, maybe you're less reliant on dodging and the, the, the weird iframes situation that I've been told about. Um, I'm undecided. I guess we'll make a decision when we start that playthrough. But for now... Um, oh, is she, that's a good point. Is she gone? No, she's still there. Okay, uh, I'm just going to try talking to her one more time since we've rested. May the and since I've I'm not going to fight her. I am so curious if she's like a full-blown boss like Artorias, though. Let me know what would happen if I fought her. Right, let's pop a few. I've added humanity to my hot things, by the way, so I can just pop them like sugar pills. Well, let's pop four. As you do. Oh, can you spam them? No, you can't. You can't. Oh, shit. Right, that's four. There we go. Okay. Let's go humanity. Uh, yeah, I'm going to try and remain human for the, the entire town, by the way. Um, I decided that before starting the episode. I'm going to play the rest of the game human. I've got 30 plus humanity to just piss away, so... And that should be... 20 flasks. Bosh. I had somebody t tell me, well, a few of you, answer my question about the Estus flasks amount. And I think the consensus is the maximum possible is plus seven, but that's unobtainable in one playthrough because of something or other. Um, I've heard the max you can get in one playthrough is plus six. Um, anyway, let's go. Hello? Whoop. Oh, this is one of those guys that was head stabbed by Artorias. By the way, I apologize um, if I. Um, oh, these are these. Oh, these remind me of the. Oh, the shit. Whatever they are. They're long and gangly like those chest head mo uh, motherfuckers. Oh fuck! No! 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 Oh damn it! Oh for God's sake! I wanted to loot. But forgive me if um, my fight with Artorius was too like too lengthy because I was being too careful, or I seemed underwhelmed at the fight. Um, I, it was at the the end of a very long episode. Like, I think the episode was only what three and a half hours long. But keep it in mind, I edited a lot out in doing like starting and and searching around for the DLC. So that three and a half hour episode was actually like six hours of recording. So by the time I got to the Artorias fight, I was absolutely exhausted. I mean, you know, six hours of recording to camera is not easy. It's fucking, it's draining. So by the time I got to that very awesome fight, cool design, cool fight, probably my favorite boss so far. There's something nice about a sort like a, just a proper sword wielding man or, or woman you just, just a humanoid boss rather than like a dragon do you know what I mean so that might have been my favorite boss but I, I, I came across as like underwhelmed or just tired during the fight it's because of the long recording it's not because I didn't enjoy the fight it was a fantastic fight but that's another argument for not doing like many many hour long recordings oh you f shit yeah Eventually, I just get very, very tired, and by that point, I'm just like, ugh. It's one thing playing just on your own for six hours. It's a whole other thing. To have a hot studio light on, a room that's getting really hot in, in the summer. You know, getting lost and confused, talking non-stop for six hours. It can really drain you. Dude, this katana. I, I was gonna put the Fury Sword on. 
I've got a lightning spear as backup in case there's something weak to lightning, but this this katana. It's a toss-up between this katana and the fury sword as to which to use. By the way, I've had like four of you. Tell me. Check everywhere in this township. Like, literally. There must have been five or six comments saying the exact same words. Make sure you check everywhere in this town. So clearly there's something good or important in this town. And another thing is... You know, I was thinking between episodes how in this game a lot of shit only seems to trigger when you not only rested a fire... Fucking hell. Right, these guys are fucking me up. Not only rest in a fire, but also go, like, uh, get a loading screen. Because it resets all sorts of shit that even resting at a fire doesn't fix. Um. Which, I've got to say, that it was one of my least favourite things about Elden Ring. And I guess it, it's the same in all of the games. Because it is, it's already difficult enough. To figure out like side quests and stuff, but then add on to the add on the fact that shit shit officially doesn't progress unless you get a loading screen. Not even resting at a fire, but you've got to leave the area completely for a shit to progress. It just adds an extra level of like confusion. Oh oh, hang on, we've got a casty boy. I've had a few people tell me, by the way, that Onion Head, it, his next position is in Lost Isleth. Um, and since I've already been to Lost Isleth, and I guess I missed him, uh, I don't mind. It's not really, I don't consider it a spoiler, because I've already been there. I don't know how I didn't see him. But before the end of the game, we will be going to Lost Isleth. Ah, you, you shit! You googly eye shit. Dude, the monsters in the abyss have, like, a thousand eyes. Ooh, hello. Weird reference, but they kind of remind me of, like, um, monsters in World of Warcraft. Like, old god sort of monsters. They tend to have lots of eyes. Ooh. This, you know, this place is fucking big. There's clearly places to go everywhere. Hello down there. There really is lots of places to go. Hello. Is, hang on, it's just, uh, just going to check one. One quick thing. Da, 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 da. Yeah, my face is in center. Right. Okay. Oh. Well, I can jump down, but I want that shit. Well, I'm guessing it all connects, so let's just jump down for now. I don't know why, but I'm getting Blight Town vibes. Oh, that's right. That's getting through my shield. That must be magic damage. Oh, right. Hang on. Will this let me go back up to? Yes, it will. I want every scrap of loot. God, this, yeah, this is definitely going to take an entire episode, isn't it? Christ. If I've missed shit, don't worry. I'll be, I'll be back. Fucking hell. Whew. 
green. Oh, you can farm these for green shards. Uh, why are two of the chests open? Dark Orb. That sounds like a spell to me. Dark Orb. Abyss Sorcery discovered by an Ulaseal Sorcerer on the brink of madness. Fire Giant Dark Orb. In contrast to standard soul sorceries, Abyss Sorceries are weighty and inflict physical damage. Oh. Well, why the fuck's he getting through my shield then? <laughs> I assume that's Abyss Sorcery they're firing at me, but that's... That's not doing physical damage. Perhaps human souls, because of the humanity produced sorcery. Oh, okay. Well, I shan't be using that, but um, I'm grateful for it all the same. Uh. Well, that ain't good. I'm curious to get back to present times to see this area, like look down the cliff and see what's there now, because I've forgotten. Um. As far as I can remember, oh, as far as I can remember, there's. N I'm sorry, carving. What was that? Um. Yeah, as far as I can remember, there's nothing off the side of the cliff. Just, just scenery. Arch tree carving says, "I'm sorry." I'm sorry, carving. Head carved of arch trees by Go Gao in his imprisonment. Guff. Go. Gao. I'm saying Gao. Gao imparts an emotion to each and every completed carving, which helps him achieve personal enlightenment. When a head is disturbed, it speaks, reflecting the emotion conferred to it. This head says, I'm sorry. Have another look. Isn't that an impression, expression of atonement? This is some wooden carving by Gao. You can use it. Oh, well, I'll keep it for now, but... Yeah, I'll remember you can use that. I wonder if there's other ones. I don't want to use it now, and it turns out I needed to use it near some special tree or some shit. Um. Go down here. Oh, hello. Let there be light. What the fuck is that sound? Usually these messages are, are physically oriented in a specific direction. Like that one is pointing that way exactly. Is this going to reveal like a hidden path or something? Oh, people have pointed out a very good point, by the way. Like two episodes ago now. Hello. Yeah, people have been, yeah, saying, and I can't believe I didn't figure this out myself, put pyromancy on my right hand so I can have a shield and, and you know what I mean? Hang on, we reorient this shit. And I can't believe I didn't think of putting pyromancy as my attack in hand anyway, because I'm never using a sword and a pyromancy at the same time, so why the fuck have I got pyromancy in my left hand? <laughs> you know what I mean? And I agree. Unless I want two weapons specifically to switch between. But most of the time I don't want to do that. Jesus Christ, come on. Where is it? Uh, that's it, I guess, yeah. So I can always just switch and always have a shield protecting me. Much better idea. But, let's put on a lantern. I mean, this got, that light message isn't there for no reason. <laughs> I've got too much stuff, man. Uh, there's, got, there's got to be some meaning to that shit. Well, thanks for the developer message. I'm glad that message is there. And I'm glad I had the foresight to actually listen to it. I wonder if there's any other doors that open with light, you know. 
Because how often are you going to try that just randomly at near walls? Surely that's the only light door. I'm going to keep that as long as I'm not fat rolling. No, I'm going to keep that lantern on. And I'm going to add that to my repertoire of wall killing things. So rolling first, sword attack second, lantern third. Anyway, let's read that item. Silver pendant deflects dark. Silver pendant engraved with the crest of Artorius. One of the ancient treasures of Anorlando presented to Artorius for facing the abyss. Effectively deflects the dark of the abyss, especially in its magic forms. But it's not like something you can equip. You can use it. Oh. Again, I don't want to just use it and then it lasts for five minutes or some shit. Um. Especially in his magic forms. Well, I'll wait until I'm facing some darkness of the abyss before I, pop, I use that. Um. Yeah. See, this is the problem. I don't know what, um. You know. That might be just a once, a one use thing for all I know. Maybe you've got to use it against the big old boss of this place. Which I'm still assuming is that big fucking thing that grabbed me through the portal. There's no way that's not the final boss. Oh, you bastard, I knew it. Stamina. You know what, let's two-hand the sword for a little while. I want more damage. Very good carving. Oh, that's the second carving I've got. Arch tree carving says very good. I'm sorry, very good. It says, I'm sorry. D does this make my guy say something? Hmm. Let me just use one. I mean, f fuck it. I can't just keep collecting shit and not using it when I can use it. You know what I'm saying? Let's say, uh, let's say very good. Very good. That sounded like Michael Gambon. Like Dumbledore. Kind of. Very good. Interest. Is that gone now? Oh, no, it's not. Oh, right, so it's unlimited. I'm sorry. <laughs> I love that voice. I'm sorry. It uh, sounds like a cross between Michael Gambon and Sean Connery. I'm sorry, Harry. Whoa! Dark Spirit, what the fuck? Whoa, shield out. I, I, I missed the net. Oh, fuck you with you. Long range weapon. Whoa! I, f I missed the name. Oh, you yeah, see? This is why I've been going human. Let's push this motherfucker. I'm gonna have your balls for breakfast, motherfucker. Um. Are you kidding me? Right. Hang on. I need to get past him. I'd love to get past him. Can, can I get past you? Thank you. I, I want to kill this guy in one hit with Chaos Storm. Fucking hell! Fucking hell! Right, his bows are ridiculous damage. Right, okay, f fuck, the, fuck the style. I've just got to kill this guy. Right, his bow is fucking super huge damage. Oh, right, okay, this guy's actually really tough. Have you seen his fucking health? But not that tough. Oh, I pressed the wrong... I, I'm used to pressing the, the left button to do your pyromancy. I just missed it. Um, if I can do that again, I'll finish with Chaos Storm. Can you stop trying to s leg sweep kick me, please? Hang on, is this, uh... Isn't this the masked stranger? He's wearing the same hat as the masked friendly guy who could sell your home bones and other shit. 
It looks exactly the same. Even with that Viva Vendetta looking mask. I bet it is the same guy, you know, and he was just pretending to be friendly. He loves his fucking cakes, doesn't he? <laughs> I can just stand here for days. <laughs> Wee! Ooh, fucking hell! He's got like a seven foot leg, man. Alright, I want to get behind him and stun him with a big old backstab. You suck, dude. No! Damn it! I did the same thing again. I pressed the left... Right, this is annoying the shit out of me. Um... You know what, let's just... Right, I'm used to also the fireballs going around the left edge of, like, a wall. In my left hand. I wonder if I can do this. Um... <laughs> Marvelous Chester. Dark Spirit Marvelous Chester. I got 20,000 runes or something. No loot? Really? Really? Nothing? Not, not even humanity items? That was a bit of shit. Okay. Um... I'll be honest, I'm sorely tempted to go back and see if that dude is there. Because that looked exactly like him. Right, that's, that's the first invader I've had that dropped fuck all loot. Unless I did something wrong, or I've already got the loot that he would drop or something. That's a little bit of bullshit. Maybe I should have lit him up or something. I'm half wondering if light is like more than just something that opens walls in this place. Like it's got some serious like meaning behind it. Maybe it could damage people. Anyway. I probably missed like seven things above me and behind me. You little bastard. Oh, that fucking follows you! Oh, that's a, that's a shame right there. Oh, fuck me. Right, okay, that really follows you. I've just got to take my fucking sweet time here. Fuck you. Well, I don't need to be human anymore, I'm guessing, because... I've never seen more than one invader in an area, so that must be it. But I'd like to just be human anyway, because I look so much sexier. Very cool skybox. Uh, sort of ground down there. Swirling darkness. Fucking hell, look at the size of the hands of these gangly fuckers. Look at that. Look at that fucking claw. Dude. Oh. Oh my god, there's so much shit here. I can always home bone my my way back up. Cause I'm sure I've missed some shit up there, but... It's all good. I will double and triple check everywhere before I like, start fighting final bosses, you know what I'm saying? Hello! Fuck you. I put the poise ring back on, by the way. I think. You suck. I'm tempted, honestly. Uh, my dodge game and parry game has never been more on point. I'm tempted to take the poise ring off and put on the critical damage one. Because I'm getting backstabs like there's no tomorrow. Uh, rubbish. Somebody shit on me for selling my rubbish to the snake because apparently you can do something with rubbish. So I'm glad I just got another. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe the snake can eat it or something? Anyway. Ooh. 
don't know why, but suddenly I'm having Minds of Moria, like, Dwarf, Lord of the Rings, Home, like, Home Under the Mountain vibes. Very cool. Ooh. Right, okay, I'm getting lots of motherfuckers in here. Um, well, I'm all for just whipping some fools, I'll be honest. Whoa! <gasps> Fuck you! Fucking hell! I specifically went out of my way to see if there was any caster guys rather than regular guys, and there was not. I didn't see a single caster, so I thought I was safe. Suddenly I get double blasted from different directions. Go fuck yourself. Well, I don't need to be human anymore, but it would be nice. Is that person still there? <gasps> They're not. They're fucking not. Ah, oh, so she, right. Oh, well, okay. She had nothing more for me, so doesn't matter. I don't need to be human, but it, it just it is nice. So I don't look like this, <laughs> like a rotten ham. <laughs> I've got to do it. I've got to play the rest of this game like a human. Right, now's a, a second opportunity, however, to see if I missed anything. I don't want to spend too long killing the same guys again and again and again. Oh my god, there's shit everywhere. I did see a little thing down there, by the way. I'll just quickly run back up. Maybe you can jump down. There. Although, no, there's nothing down there. Right, uh, I guess I've got to kill everything again. It's kind of a shame. No, you can't jump to that. That's ridiculous. I'm so used to pyromancy being in my left hand, you know. Are these blind? Because they are... And they're all looking away, but they're not noticing that I'm here. I wonder if... Should I try putting on the ring that makes me silent? I don't really need the poise right now, because I'm, I'm not getting hit whilst I'm attacking. No sound whatsoever. There you go. I'm wondering if they're... Like, I, mm, I don't know. I think they might just be regular mobs, but they're not looking at, in my direction. No, they've seen me. Right, okay, they're not, they're not blind at all. Oh god, this is bad. This is bad. E. Okay, so they're just regular mobs. Um, I guess there's no harm in keeping my silence uh, ring on. Might let me run past a couple, maybe. Oh god. Although, is there any need, really? You know what? I don't think it did miss anything. I actually think I aced this area. Yep. Let's just go for it. It is, uh... I'll tell you what, that's... The reason I'm not wearing the chest armor is because that makes noise. Wearing this ring does directly, like, um... 
negate that, if you see what I mean. Allowing you to wear heavy armor and not make sound. Um, but yeah, there's, you know, they can see me, so there's no point wearing that. Let's just go, uh... I do like the stamina recovery. <laughs> Defense versus physical. The wolf ring. Is, is Artorius' ring, by the way. I keep forgetting that. The wolf ring belongs to Artorius the Abyss Walker. You know, let's put that on. It's, it's extra fitting since we're in the Abyss. I missed. Um, now I'm tempted to put on the ring. Uh, blows it. I got their head. <laughs> That's great. Da -da 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 -da. Oh yeah, that symbol of avarice. <laughs> Super heavy. Um, but yeah, bloated head, much lighter. Fantastic poison resist and curse resist. No poise. Interesting. Um, yeah. I've got a soft humanity, by the way. If I put on the Fury Sword, my damage will be increasing. And these fuckers don't have armor on, so they're weak to fire. Let's switch for the uh, Fury Sword. Now I'm doing more damage. Oh, yeah. Um, I'll kill this fucker, but I'm going to put on the magic, um, high magic protection shield. I don't think this one's very good. No, 40% reduction to magic. Whereas I've got one that's at least 80. I'm sure I had one that was like 90. That wasn't heavy. Hang on. Oh, fuck me. How many fucking shields? It has to be 100 and higher than 80. I did have a 90, but it doesn't block physical. No. Right, that's the best one. That should help a little bit. Right, let's not have a repeat, shall we? Fucking hell. Right, this is higher damage. Bloody hell. Nice. Let's two hand and see if I can one shot kill. Whoa, fucking hell. Calm down, would you? Uh, my damage was exactly the same then when I was two handing. The fuck? Is that because it's fire damage and not physical? Because strength increases when you two-hand. Not fire? That would explain a great many things. And if that's true, that it means there's absolutely no f Well, very, very little benefit. Let me just do... Right. Two, three, seven. That doesn't count because he didn't have enough health. Um... Oh, that's a, right. Okay. Um, uh, yeah. Spells on different heights don't seem to work very well. So, um, where's the other? Oh, there was a second spell one that fucked me as well. Um, I can't see the second one. Anyway, can I right hand toss a fireball? I want to get on the rim, if you see what I'm saying. Um, I can't, there's no easy way of getting on the lip. Uh, oh, okay. It's fine. No, it is less, isn't it? No, it is. I'm completely wrong. That's 160 versus 230-ish. So it is increasing the damage. Okay. Can I... I want to run and jump on the edge. I mean, that's a fucking dangerous move. <laughs> no, okay, never mind. Um. Oh. Uh. Oh, fucking hell! Oh, he's up there. Right. I see you up there, little bastard. Um. Can I get down here and have the pillar in my way? Oh, 
Oh, the poi- the, the poise was working well then. So I'm wondering who the other two knights are. I mean, we, we quite possibly know who the other two knights are already, and I'm just... I've completely forgotten. Um, I'm guessing Gwyn's daughter, Guinevere, and son, Gwendolyn, don't count as knights of Gwyn. They're just the children of Gwyn, so who are the knights? Um, I don't know Google. I think we've probably already been told. I've just forgotten, like an idiot. Well, I don't have an easy way of killing that fucker up there. So I've just got to avoid him for now. Oh, can I just run round to him? I think we'll be able to. Dude, I'm getting lost and confused here. This is, this is not headed towards that caster. You know, for a place called the Abyss, this is not, you know, shit. This is not very evil looking, at least yet. It just looks like a nice little castle. I'm sure I missed more shit down there. We, we will return. Hello. No, 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 you, you bastard. Now, he's, his pathfinding is leading him to me. Oh, they, right, I must be able to get there. Hang on. He found it very easy to get to me just then. Ah, oh, did he run and jump off there? Right, fucker. Fucker. Let's keep going. Right, that's the room beneath me. Actually, this reminded me of um, some of the castle area in the painted world, strangely enough. Just a bit less snowy and cold. And weird. Oh. Um, oh, can I run and jump onto there? Oh, let's fucking hell, let's go back again. Let's go back again and not get shot by fucker. Lady in red. She's dancing with me. God only knows. Oh, what a little leap. Professional leapage. Loot. Ooh, red junk. Oh, I need. I probably need to restart my game at some point. It was doing that minimizing shit earlier. It hasn't done it since starting the episode, though, so... For now, I think we're good. I'm just light this bitch up. What? Are you fucking for real? What? What are the? What? What are the chances in that? that like the first time, basically, that I've tried doing that in like by some walls, it actually, it actually worked. I swear on my life, I didn't know this was here. That that looks like I'm cheating, and I've I've checked all this shit beforehand. I swear on my life, I didn't know that was there. What the fuck? I think I've gotten very, very lucky with some illusory walls and shit in this game. But the 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 luckiest was still that first one I found uh, to get to the fair lady spider. That was just pure fucking luck. Um, I didn't find the double the double wall that led down to the ash lake. Somebody had to tell me for that for that one. That was the one thing that's been spoiled for me in this game. But what the fuck is that? Oh. I mean, I'll say it again, but in a different manner. What the fuck is that? What what utter use is there in that fucking shortcut? I mean, really? 
I appreciate it. I, I like finding the door, but it would be kind of cool if the door would go somewhere. But it is what it is. You know, I'm just going to walk around with the fucking light up. I really, really appreciate the loud sound cue as well when you reveal a door. That's really helpful. Is Hang on. Real quick. Is there any markings giving this door away? There isn't, is there? See, the sticky out stones, but they're all over the wall. Um... Although there are sticky out stones all around it. I wonder if there's if I see like a rectangle of sticky out stones slightly. I wonder if that sort of reveals it. Because there was absolutely no sign. I just figured we went all the way around for what? A, a chest, I guess, but then nothing. So I thought, you know what, let's check for a door. And there was one. It would be very cool if you had to have a lantern raised. To reveal like an Indiana Jones invisible floor uh, thing at some point. This is the abyss after all. Well, how the f is there any point to being up there then? Or is there just that guy chilling in there? I think it's, I think he's just chilling in there. Well, let's. I'm gonna try and run past all the uh, spell. Whoa, yeah, little shit. I need to run past the incoming. Oh, get fucked. I can't decide if I like the Fury Sword more or the Katana. Th there is no comparing the coolness of a Katana. Oh, he's down. He fell down. Yeah, you can't get cooler than a Katana. It's, it's the height of just excellence and beauty. And elegance in swordplay. You, you cannot be a Katana. But at the same time, a flaming fucking sword. Come on, man. So I can't decide which I like more. Um, If I can dodge that shit. Bad. All bad. Much, much bad. All of the bad. I want it to... No. Bad. Bad. Just, just... Right, let's back off. Let's stop being a Billy Belland. Fuck you. Oh, you penis. You shit. You fuck. Cock. No. Oh. Oh, I thought I killed one. So I thought I was safe shielding from the second and then attacking. Nope, I didn't kill the first one. And I lost my softy man. I meant what I said about being human for the rest of the game, by the way. <laughs> Why not? Um, I think I might try the running past all these fuckers this time. And then just fighting whatever the fuck is down the bottom. Oh, right, yeah, sprinting. They all heard me. Okay, let's run past them. I just can't be asked fighting every single one of them every time, you know? Do they leave me at some point? Let's go the other way, because I, I, otherwise I've got to get past that fucker. I think that was a pro move right there. That was a fucking professional move. Oh! Little shiny boy! Hang on, hang on. No! It's going to be too late, isn't it? Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> All these fuckers are like falling off and shit behind me. Oh, the magic reduction is working wonders. I'm taking like way less damage. That's trivial now I've got that shield on. Oh, they give me poison. All right. Well, I'm glad to see you can just run past them and they either die or just give up. That's nice. Okay. Very good. 
At least I'll be getting the soft humanity back, which will increase my damage again a little bit. Um, let's aggro some, but let's get in this corridor so I can't get shot. Let's get this shit back. I need to get used to the pyromancy being my right hand. It's weird. Oh, I want to do like a walk off, like falling attack, but you can't. Come on, you bastard. Now, where was I going? I was going across there to loot and keep going, wasn't I? Come on, you little bastards over here. Oh, I had that hit him. Dude, my power attack is a one shot kill. With this sword, one handed. And keep in mind, with this uh, weapon, the power attack is just as fast as the light attack. My magic wins? No, it doesn't. Whoa! New attack. Right, okay. They can dodge just as well as I can. <laughs> All right. I don't know what made that fucker fall off last time. These guys are all laughing. Have you, have you heard the fuckers? They're all laughing at me. They sound like the hyenas from the Lion King. Just taunting you. Anyway. Anyway. Can it, will, is he going to hit the little wall up there if he fires at me? Yes, he is. That's great. Stay right there. No, no, no. No, he's not. What the fuck was that, man? What the fuck? Fuck off, man! These fucking bastards! Fuck! I, I can't get a second to, to breathe, I think! Right, double heal, double heal. Fucking hell, man. They're, they're deceptively fucking fast and strong. Fucking die, you fucking shits! Christ alive! I tell you, I thought I was safe from the caster. It turns out I was, and then I'm, I've got two fuckers plastering me. Right, die, all of you, right. How many more? Right, it's just the caster. Right, fuck you up there. If I do my lot, my lot, my chaos storm. Do you reckon that might hit him? It is a weird, it's a, it's a weird spell, like. That one of the lava things might fall up there. Right, no, I guess not. It is weird, sometimes it does weird shit like that. It was worth checking. What the fuck did I just hear? What did he do? Oh, there's no, there's no fog doors. Right, that's not a thing. Okay. Okay, fuckers. Little pesky bastards. I don't want to die again. You know, I keep forgetting the lantern is actually like a shield. It's a shit one, but it does reduce damage by like 50%. So in a pinch, I'll just keep the lantern raised rather than try and fumble about switching shit. Right, every time I've seen one of these lanterns, it's been quite a safe area. Oh, 
Right, before we end, before we run the gauntlet, what's, what's back here? Oh, is this the shortcut back to the top? Let's end, let's activate. That's a nice little shortcut, thank fuck for that. <laughs> fuck you. Okay. I killed him just by magic. Mind powers. I've got a second soft humanity. Right, in other areas of the game, you get a soft humanity like every like 40 kills or so. It's a, it's a large amount of kills. But in this place, I'm getting a soft humanity every like 10 kills. Might be exaggerating, but, but less than other areas of game. Hang on. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm dubious now with the whole light situation. Right, okay. Right, let's run the old gauntlet. I don't think I've missed anything. There was a couple of bits of loot I know I've missed, like up on rooftops, so there's clearly more areas. I reckon I've probably missed an area um, to get out on rooftops and balconies and shit. I'll keep that in mind, so don't worry. Because I, I remember seeing one piece of loot that was up there. You fuckers. You, you, you fuckers. You pieces of fuck. Charge! That's right, bitch. You ain't shit. One strong running attack and they're fucked. I kind of wish my Chaos Fireball had like a long range. Because it's got a very, very short range and then it explodes literally 10 meters away. It's not long at all. But other magic is just unlimited range. <laughs> Who are you laughing at? My magic wins, bitch. And your magic loses. Oh, poor canal! I keep... I need to use my eyes. They look like normal mobs. Unless I look close. Dude, fuck it out. Right, they've got some cool attacks. I love the sound of that attack. That's great. I admire your moveset, sir. You are very cool. Oh god, watch out, watch out, watch out. Right, okay, clearly. Uh, area boss... Fog door, the second I walk through, point of no return. Should I be checking for all your balcony loot now? Before I do this. Um. Tell you what, let's, let's be smart about this, right? Let's not cross any threshold. Let's whip out... A pair of binoculars. And see what this is. <laughs> Uh, right, it looks like, I don't even know, I don't have any descriptors, ev uh, like, in all my experience of life, that that is like anything else. That is, that is not a thing. There's no head, <laughs> there's no limbs, it kind of looks like it's got three legs, or tentacles, it's got chains and like a spike for a head. Is that like the top half? Oh, fuck knows. Clearly, though, this is some serious shit I'm about to enter here. Um, tempted to get a pine resin out just for extra damage. Um, I might rock Katana, though. It, it, I'll keep the Fury Sword, fuck it. Um, and I won't bother with the pine resin. I could really do with uh, spending my shit. And I do have a shortcut right there that goes to the, to the thing. Um, you know what? I'm going to do what I said I was going to do. Because of that shortcut, I can come back in nice and easy now. So let's quickly... Uh, tell you what I'll do. I'm going to go back up, level up. Because I've just got to pop one item. A souls item and I can level up. Then I'll come back down and try and search for any more loot before shit hits the fan. And we fight whatever that spike head was. 
Somebody told me that as well that I missed a chest back in the stone area. Uh, use the basic ones, is that enough? Yes, it is. Right, do I want one more health for this coming fight? Or, like, significantly more damage? Here, or more stamina, even. At this point, I feel like my damage is fine. You know what, let's put a point in the health. You can't go wrong with more health. Right, I've got pretty much nothing to lose now. I mean, I've got two soft humanity. Uh, <laughs> I'm human and I've got two soft humanity, so that's three humanity on the line. But at this point, I've got the invader, so that's irrelevant now. I don't need to be human anymore. And what else am I going to do with my humanity? It, it's there to increase my damage, so... Fuck it. It can only help. I'm gonna save all my pyromances. Can't even see, bruh. <laughs> okay. Right. I forgot those two of these fuckers. I might have to fireball one of them. kill the other one. <sighs> you blue bastard. Right, okay, full health, 19 flasks. Most of my pyromances, I think we're good. Whatever awaits us. Uh, let me just take this opportunity to make sure I'm still recording and everything is still fine. No problems, we're still recording. Um, I'll just do one quick thing. There we go. Da, da, da. No delay, that's good. Okay. Let's commence. God, it's warm in here, man. Hello, Spike Face. So far, so good. This is, t look, this is like one hell. This, it's moving. This boss arena reminds me of, uh, Moog from Elden Ring. What is this? This doesn't seem like a basic... Uh, sorry. Basic. This doesn't seem like a boss. This room smells of, like, major boss. But this is just some basic bitch. By the way, it looks armored, so I think this sword might be shit. Yep. <laughs> That's a yes. Right, let's uh, get this fucker to attack me. Good. Thanks for missing. That said, this is also Slash. So this might be just as useless. No! Ooh! Yeah. Black Knight Sword might have to come out. Yep. Either that or the Lightning Spear. You know, let's try paramancing it. Oh, fuck it, hell. Get slapped. At least... it's The fire sword doesn't work, but I think that's the slash that's letting it down, not the fire. It seems to be otherwise weak to fire. Like, weak as shit. Get fucking slapped. <laughs> let's, uh... I'm not even going to use Chaos Storm, let's just fire whip the motherfucker. Get whipped, boy! <laughs> Chain Helm and Leather... Okay, so that wasn't a boss at all. Um, What was the weapon? There was a head and then a weapon, wasn't there? I missed that, I'm, I'm shit, I'm not paying attention.
I'll have to watch the episode back, I guess. I completely missed that. Yeah, right, from now on, if I see like a, even a, like a semi-armoured looking boss guy, I've got to put the curved swords away, they're, they're useless. I suppose that is the main argument for having pyromancy in the left hand. It lets me equip two weapons of different types just in case. Because then it's a pain in the ass trying to get distance enough to switch my weapons. But anyway, let's continue before I commit. Any, uh... I might as well try, you know what I'm saying? Might as well. I doubt there's anything here though. Nah. I've got to do my due diligence though. Check most places. Alright, what the fuck is the deal here? Oh, we have- <gasps> Oh, Carol! You, you little bastard. Right, so we're going even further down. Ooh, bonfire. Oh, my, my humanity. My humanity. Brilliant. I only need to pop one more. Hang on. This place is, uh... I've had, like, three more people tell me to go back to the asylum, by the way. Oh, I'm hearing a terrifying rumbling. Um, I just need to pop one humanity and then this will kindle to max. Thank you, soft humanity. Losing a bit of damage, but it's all gravy. I'd rather just kindle everything to max. Uno mess. Ooh, right. Let's do this. Let me just rest. Make sure I die rested. Alright. Okay. This is fucking terrifying. Like, see, oh god, have we got another catacomb segment where it's fucking pitch? Oh god. Oh my god, no. I can see red shit and then lit up shit. Oh, it is another fucking catacombs, isn't it? Right, I think a couple of those are loot items, and then the, the other ones are like light lighting gems. What the fuck? Oh, are these the regular mobs, but their eyes are lit up. Oh shit! No, no, Mr. Frodo! No, no, no! Oh, you fucking idiot. You fucking idiot. You fucking fool, man. Twinkle. Thank God for that. Right, yeah, okay, so the, their eyes light up. They look like big daddies <laughs> from Bioshock. That's hilarious. And also very menacing and terrifying. I can't tell that there is a caster there at the back, I can see him. That's bad. Much or bad. Let's back off a little bit, get some distance. Um, I want to try and get rid of each of the shit munchers. Like a fucking dodging masterclass right here. Ow! <sighs> that is so high damage. Oh, should I be popping that fucking pendant? Shall I try it? That 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 thing I got earlier, the necklace that said it reduces something or other. Should I be put popping that? Because this this is fucking difficult, man. 
that effectively deflects. I mean, <sighs> is it used up? No, it's not. Okay. Um, I don't have any symbols showing that that is active, though. Is that what this white shit is on me, or is that just hum the fact that I'm human or my poise or something? Hmm. Shall I? I'm tem- oh shit. I'm tempted to take a hit. I'll take one hit. That didn't help at all. What the fuck? Um, right, hang on, hang on. Since it's unlimited uses, I think. Let's back off. I'll get to full health. Um, I might try popping that thing on my hotbar and using it right before I get hit by one of those fucking things. Fast, 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 fast. Where is it? Fast, fast. <sighs> there. Right. Shield up. It said it deflects. You know what I mean? Can I just keep using it? Huh. Huh. How, how long does that last for? At least a good two or three seconds. Now, how fast does it kick in? I want to see. I want to do it really late now. Oh, bad. That was really late that I did that. Let's try it again. This is ridiculous. Bruh. No, oh, no, I don't want to get poisoned. Fuck off. Oh, I was too late that time to see that. You can do it quite late. I need to heal. That is really cool, though. I wonder if I can... You can do it quite late, but not too late. And it seems to last a decent amount of time. Can I get it to kill itself? With a deflected... Get away from me, you fucker. You shit. But that's so cool, so it's just unlimited use. I wish it was clear. Rather than get, having you worried that you might you waste it. Is he like out of mana or something? <sighs> Jesus Christ. That's fucking great. Dude, I'm glad I, I, I tested it. I can stand here for days. I can, can I just keep popping it? <laughs> yes! Un truly unlimited. You are useless, you can't hurt me, la da 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 da. <laughs> I am invincible. <laughs> we are the champion, my friends. You are useless, and I'll keep on fighting. Oh shit! No, no, no. Bad, bad, much bad, much bad, all the bad. Okay, it's all gone to shit now. <laughs> Go fuck yourself. <sighs> Fuck's sake. At least it's at least it's right here. The the poison threw me off, okay? Um <sighs> I'm 
Okay, okay, let's just, let's move past that, pretend that didn't happen. I was absolutely fine, but I, I, you know, I was getting confused trying to switch to cure the poison and then get the pendant back on, but I needed to heal and then I thought I'd roll and it fucking failed. Okay, we're human again. Let's get the pendant up. That is crazy though. Like, that's just nuts. I can't, you know, I, that that's so... I've got a car outside my house just honking his horn. No, for no reason. Fucking shut up, man. So, deflects dark. Have I got any other items in this game similar to this that are just, like, ridiculous? Like, overpowered? That I just never bothered to use? I'm sorry. Hmm. But that is so ridiculous. Makes me think that being the pendant of Artorius, he was basically immune. It is a pendant. I kind of wish you could, uh... Maybe it would be too powerful, but I kind of wish there was a necklace slot, like there's two ring slots, you know? And you could just put that on and it would just auto-deflect everything. Um... Interesting. It's a bit of a pain not being able to... You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna switch. A couple of equipment orders. Um, I want the pendant to be right after the humanity, the healing flask, and then I can hold the button down to go back instantly to health. And I want poison after that as well. Humanity is almost irrelevant. In fact, I'm not even going to put that on the thing. Um, <sighs> nothing else matters really. I've got that guardian soul as well. And Artorius was used for something special. I wonder if I can do something with the Guardian Soul. Um, let's just put on Pine Risen. Right, so w when I'm running around with heals, I just go pop to get that up. And then hold it down to get my health back. That's, that's a better system. Right, okay, let's do this. Ooh. It is interesting. You've only got a short window of opportunity, like, you know? Uh, I need to lure one at a time if I can. There you go, that's how you do that. The, these monsters have got quite a high poise. He, he's tanking my hit and not giving a fuck. Let's try and get this one here. Let's be methodical about this shit. Let's get that thing in the way, so I can't be hit. Pro moves. Using a pillar for defense. <laughs> oh, he's got his own... Well, there's another pillar. Oh, that's great. I'm just gonna stand right here. That's great. The tiny, the teeniest, tiniest, spindly <laughs> fucking pillar. Right, you suck, sir. And I'll prove it. <laughs> Dude. Dark, but I'm getting a lot of these dark spells. Let me know if, um, like, a, an Abyss magic build is, like, a sub-build of, like, a, a, a magic build. If you see what I'm saying. Like, a, an Abyss magic-only magic build. Because that sounds quite fun. Um, let me whip out the old light. Because you never fucking know. Quite frankly. Well, there's nothing here. I thought that was actually leading up somewhere. Let's do- let's follow the old video game trope. Follow the light. Right, I'm guessing that effect only lasts while those yellow things are flying around you. One, 
So after I pop it, one, two, three, I think it's exactly three seconds, which is interesting. So there is a, it's not completely foolproof, you've got to time it quite well, but I like that. I just, I love being able to, um, hello? I love being able to deflect shit magically. Reminds me of that scene towards the end of Metal Gear Solid 2, where Fortune, spoiler alert, I guess, where Fortune um, is deflecting, like, rockets and shit. And it looks very similar to when that this shit bounces off this. Now, let me get back to my original thought. What the fuck? Uh, is, this, is this the true ghost town? Like, New London is just some bullshit. These are actual fucking ghosts. They've even got two eyes. Like a cartoon ghost. I don't know why, but they remind me of the ghosts from Casper. The friendly ghost. Just just curvy and like car almost cartoonish ghosts. Right, can I... I'm getting ready to deflect some serious shit here. What the fuck? There's, there's thousands of them, man. Some are, t some are tiny. Right, either there's tiny ones and big ones, or these ones are very close to me, and those ones down there are miles away. That's terrifying. That's fucking terrifying, man. There's also magic-y boys in the distance. <sighs> Any fucking doors? Oh my god. Hello? Very cool... Oh my god. Now this actually is true ghost town. I thought there was a fog door down to the left. It's not. It's just some head looking thing. Ooh, they're moving. Are they on my ass? Are they pathfinding to me? They are. I thought they were running away. Bullshit. I wonder if light does damage to them. If, if light was to damage any mob in this game, surely it's these shadows of darkness. Oh, you can lock on. Right, they haven't fired anything at me yet. That's a good sign. Oh, there are small ones. There's like baby ghosts. Hello? They're, they're not going to be friendly, are they? Ooh! Okay, touching them, does do they just walk at you and just inevitably fuck you up? Right, this... Um, I'm going to heal to full, then I'm going to try waiting for them to get close. Siren outside my house. Uh, I'm going to wait for them to get close and try popping the... Like, for all I know, they count as darkness magic or some shit. That doesn't do shit, does it? No, it doesn't. Uh, are they going to, like, do anything? Or are they just going to walk at me? A little bit... Let's try killing them. Oh, you can hit them. Right, okay. Either this fire sword is, like, powerful as all shit, and I've just stumbled across their greatest weakness, or they're just, like, weak as fuck. They're not dropping anything, are they? I've got my, uh, loot ring on. Actually, you know what? These look like humanity items. <laughs> I don't have any equipped, but they're, like, they look very similar. Look at that. That's practically one of those ghosts. I would not be surprised if they drop humanity items. Let's, um... I'll tell you what is is called for right now. Chaos Storm. Because they don't attack and they don't lunge at you, I've got all the time in the world to, uh... Oh, I don't want that magic fucker, though. Right, I'm gonna... God help me, but I'm gonna jump down and just hope that magic one doesn't attack me. If I can corral them and kill them all with a single fucking... Chaos Storm. Ooh, they, they move quite quickly when they want to. Dude, that is so creepy. Are these like wandering souls of people that have died in the abyss or some shit? Oh, they surround you. Have you noticed? They actually surround your position. I'm pressing the wrong fucking button. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. They proper surround your position. That's terrifying, man. Say goodbye, motherfuckers! 
there's just one there's just one little baby left. Hello! I'm, I'm sorry I killed your parents. They do drop humanity. That's fitting. Cool. Right, I know where to come to farm my humanity. Nice. Right, that was the best use of Chaos Storm in this game yet. I kind of wish this was like Star Wars, where if you time this correctly, it reflects back <laughs> rather than just reflect away. Hey, you're laughing at me. I'm laughing at you, motherfucker. <laughs> if I just tap it when I see him start to cast the spell... Oh, no, poison. Fuck, no, bad. Yeah, if I do it when he starts to cast, it's plenty of time. So I'm, I should be fine until then, you know? Oh, he's fallen down. Well, you suck, sir. I wish, especially if you were close enough. I wish it would uh, reflect back on him, you know? Whew. Right, before I go too far, there was shit down here. You know? Oh, you can go around here. <laughs> oh, cat. Oh. oh, just a friendly cat. Is this the, the same cat from the guard? It's an illusory cat. We've got an illusory cat. What the fuck is going on, man? Right. Okay. I hope I haven't missed anything back there. Right. Uh, you know, let's keep the light up because I, I don't know if my light is what did that floor thing there. Oh, and the cat thing. Hello. No, that cat is just, uh... You know, there is some connection there. The cat in the original, um, garden. This is the same kind of area as the garden. There must be some connection as why I'm seeing a cat here. Okay. There's some weirdness with the cat. You know, it's a, it's almost a shame having your light up doesn't hurt these. It it feels like it should. They are like pure darkness, you know? I wonder if they're weak to fire specifically. It does seem to do a lot of damage. Kind of. I almost feel bad. They're not really doing anything. They're kind of just floating around. Ooh, hello. Let's kill these so that... Did that meow with me just then? Like, for re Okay, is it just me? Or is that one an extra big one? I think, I think it's just an extra big one. <sighs> it is fucking big, isn't it? Oh my god. In fact, that's so big. We're gonna whip some motherfuckers. There we go. Sorry to do you like that, but... Um, well, just in case this is a bonfire, I will check this out. Oh my god, is it is the creature of the abyss going to be just one gigantic humanity? <laughs> um, shortcut? It's going up, so I think it is a shortcut. Fucking hell! Fucking hell! Warp speed! Christ! <gasps> are we near the Masked Stranger? Is this where I think it is? We are! Right, let's go see if he's there. Oh, that's one nice, uh... That's a fantastic shortcut. Oh no, he's still here. Um... He's still here. So it, this wasn't the invader, even though he's dressed exactly the same. Oh, you... You have quite some nerve, or are you just thick? Fine then. What is it that you need? What the fuck is your problem? You bitch. Did 
you really slay Knight Artorias? This guy's Either voice is loud as shit. found him first, but even still, that's absolutely treacherous. Yes, magnificently so. I love this guy. <laughs> <laughs> this guy sounds like a proper outlaw, scoundrel, fucking thief guy from Vic the Victorian age. This could be like a, a young, more charming Fagin. <laughs> Believe it or not, Ulysseel has brought the abyss upon itself, fooled by that toothy serpent. They upturned the grave of primeval man and incited his ornery wrath. What could they have been thinking? But to you and I, it's all ancient history. You have to ask yourself, does it really matter? <laughs> there was, I could tell there was some serious story in what he just said then. The snake. Was he talking about Frampt or some other snake? The snake told someone something and then they upturned the grave of man and it released or created the abyss. Hmm. There's some deeper meaning there. Well, I've had an... <laughs> well... I'd love, I've had enough I'm tempted of you. to um I'm tempted to go back while I've got the opportunity and uh and talk to Mushroom Lady, see if she's got anything new to say. Um now I can go to the fire through here and warp backwards. And I'm curious if we can warp forwards actually. But if we can't, it's all good. I can just you know. Now I've got the shortcut, I can quickly zip down. Um How long have I been going? Oh, only an hour 39. We've got we've got a, like a good two and a half hours to go. Oh, that fills me with warm feelings, knowing we've we've got plenty of hours to play still. Right. Um, let's zip back. Oh, there you go. Township dungeon. That must be where I discovered you could use that pendant. I guess down below. Well, let's go. Oh no, hang on, hang on. You've got three. You've got. Sanctuary Garden, Ulysseel Sanctuary, and Township. What is Sanctuary Garden? Because it's clearly not in the Ulysseel. You know what? Let's go there. Unlimited warping for the win. Let's just look. Armor of Kirk. Oh, it is at the start of this place. Okay. Um. Well. Let's warp 20 feet forwards to the Ulysseel Sanctuary. Uh, cause that, that guy had new shit to say, I'm wondering if, if Mushroom Lady certainly probably does. Hello! How, how have you been, Mrs. Mushroom? I've killed Artorius. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Thank goodness thou art safe. You too. As I wish, I offer thee my all. I want information. Not long ago. I had another visitor, a human like thine self, from a far away time. Artorius? Only he was dreadfully odious, and I'm afraid that he is still amongst us. He wore a hat and oh. a long black coat. Yeah, the guy who called me thick. I think that masked stranger must be my favorite NPC so far. Just straight up, cheeky and suave. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Was thine eye glancing hither? Thou needst not hide thy wonder. I am a mushroom, after all. <laughs> okay. Thou needst well, not hide thanks for the wonder. info. Let's um, zip forwards. Very interesting. I wonder if that masked stranger has more story behind him. He hasn't had anything that sounds like a quest yet. Just. Laughing at me, calling me thick, and then selling me some shit. Right, well, let's go back down. I'm so glad you can just straight up fast travel in this game. I wonder if um, this silver pendant would have... You get this after you fight what his face, but I wonder if this would have blocked any of Artorius's attacks. Because think about it, in a new new game plus, I will already have this pendant. Unless this is like a rare item that gets removed when you start a new game plus. 
Because I know in Elden Ring you do lose some items. I I've got a very loud rumbling sound and I think it's real life. There's something big outside my house right now. Well, I mean, I'm not gonna... Forgive me, but I'm not gonna kill everything. I kind of want to run past everything. Um, does that make me a dick? Uh, you know what? Uh, I might have to because... Oh, sorry. No, no, no. Sorry. It's down there. Right. I'll just pull one and then I'll, I can walk off to the side. What am I smoking? Okay. Let me whip out the... Fucking hell. Calm down, would you? Well, all those humanities are going to be alive again. Oh, look at them. I have been popping humanities like Tic Tac, so uh, I might want to just kill them again. Fuck it. So that was a shortcut, but wasn't there more down there? To the left, because I, I want to go right, but then I want to go left at the same time, you know? Right, come at me, humanities. Oh, I'm surrounded. As long as I don't let them touch me. Have you seen the way they strafe left and right to block me off? It's it's crazy. It's like they're organized. Yeah. Oh, you've got to proper touch them to get hit, though. So that's good. You can just run between them. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry, I should be more scared of them, but for some reason I find them cartoonish. And just kind of hilarious. They look like cartoon ghosts. Whee! <laughs> it's just, I like the little round heads. Alright, okay, calm down. Ooh, I'm taking some damage, but that's fine. That's fine. To be expected. Ow, fuck it. Ooh, they do damage when they want to. They really do damage when they want to. Now, I've got to be careful. One single cast and I'm dead from that other fucker over there. Right, okay. I'll get a little bit more distance next time I pop that Chaos Storm. <laughs> Ooh, that's two humanities, plus I got three or four then. Nice. Right, come at me, motherfucker. You ain't shit. You ain't shit. I don't think I can pop my thing up there. No, I can't. I need him to come down. Did he just spawn a human, a, a little ghosty boy? I need this guy to walk off the edge. I can't do shit. I'm actually, I'm so hot in here, I'm, I'm, I'm dripping. <laughs> and not with swag. Another humanity. Fucking hell, right, this is the place to farm humanities. If I don't finish the game this episode, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll farm these fuckers, if, there's, if I can figure out a fast way of doing so. I'm going to farm these, get 80 humanity. <sighs> My bad. Um, and then I can give 80 to Chaos Lady Spider. Now, can you please come down? I need you, I need you to... Let's get close enough. Maybe they'll try and melee me. There we go. Ooh, that was close. Get slapped. There is loot up there, so there's, there's some connection here. Okay, that's not a thing. Uh, well, clearly, it's some way up, so let's just quickly check down here. I, 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 I should probably go back the other way first, I feel like. This is not going down, like... Oh, fuck. 
Oh my god, I'm surrounded. Let's just commit. Fuck it. Commit. Commit like a frog. Nice. Like I need more humanity. Okay, you know, I'm, I am sorely to... Right, okay, right, this is the way to go. I am gonna go back, fall down to Cat Place and, and see what... There was something else by the elevator. And clearly this is not the way to get to that loot, so there must be some back way. Like, that must be a shortcut back from down there. So, let's go. And I'm curious, like, about that cat. Curiosity did kill the cat. And I'm curious, and I'm gonna kill that fucking cat. Right, come here. They are actually quite resistant even to fire. I am curious um, to see if regular swords just go straight through these, and it's the fire that's letting me damage them without even realizing. Fuck it out. Right, J don't jump into them because that's just bad. I might as well kill them. In our face! The lava should kill him. Oh, they can just float through the lava. Fucking hell, these do do more damage. Ow. Charge! I must say, I do think it would be great if popping this thing, like, literally like one shot killed them or something. Or at least push them back. Right, okay, let's go down. Although it is going down, so I don't see it really hooking up with the high shit. Uh, maybe. Oh, this place is fucking enormous. This one's running away from me. Yeah, I know I've killed like your your, your fourteen thousand ghost b brothers and sisters, but stop running. I will fireball you. Oh right. Okay. There's the item. Okay, that geography does not make sense in my head. How the fuck am I up here? Don't question it. Let's keep going down. How did I miss? Oh, this is the fucking hell that big. Oh, that big. I think a double whip hit kills him. Double whip it is. Oh, I'm out. Okay. That one seems oddly resistant. This is better than the catacombs, because I've got a magical dark pendant shield, I can see better even without light. In the catacombs you can't see shit. And the Tomb of the Giants. Uh, sorry, I'm thinking of the Tomb of the Giants, yeah, that is true pitch black. I might as well two hand, really. They're really, because there's no detail on these, it's hard to tell how close you are to them, you know what I mean? He's just standing there. Humanity. Hey, I think I might... Black frame, I'm getting more and more. I might have got more humanity than I've used, and I've used a lot today. You know what, I think I was on 34 when I started. Maybe even like 32, so I think I've actually gained, despite using a bunch.
Well, I think we're good. I don't think there's anything else. Right, let's approach Fog Door. God help us all. Assuming I don't get slapped on the way down there. I've got 14 flasks, which ain't bad. Not enough souls to care about. I think we're good. Ooh. Oh, what am I doing? I need to... I need to... Go this way. This has been such an enjoyable game and experience overall. I can't wait to get into 2 and 3. I've heard so much about Dark Souls 3 in recent-ish years that it makes me think Dark Souls 3 is people's favourites, but it, all the talk might just be because it's the most recent Dark Souls game. Rather than it being the best. I am definitely the most intrigued about 2, though, just because of the crazy differences. And I, we've, we've, I'm good to start the end boss, basically, outside of the DLC and uh, a couple of extra bits. Ooh, hello. Fucking hell. Fucking hell, that's high damage I'm taking. Fucking hell. Gee, you've got to be careful against these fuckers. I am sorely tempted. Now, before I go through this fog door. A white slab. Okay. Now, what did you need the white slab for? Was that divine and occult to max level? I don't think it's anything else. I'm tempted to go back up to the town now while all my shortcuts are engaged and open. Is that a good idea? To go back through the town, because there's def I know there's a couple of fucking balcony things I've missed. And I don't want to kill the final boss of this area, and then the DLC becomes, like, inaccessible. I, I doubt that's the case. Because why would the fuck would you just lose access to every all these warpable places? Um, I'll just check the surroundings of the door, but I won't go through it just yet. I might have one of these moments where I sort of have to edit it down for YouTube, but I might go back and try and find some shit. I think I'll just go full-blown, no commentary mode. What the fuck am I looking at? Maybe it's not a boss door, because that those are regular mobs down there. Or are they? Got one big fireball. Let's just uh there, perfect. Ow. More fucking out. This is place is great for humanities. Soul of a hero. Okay, I'm seeing some lots of big black red shit down there, but I don't think they are regular mobs. I think there is some big shit through here. Um. Oh. I'm gonna commit. We're here now. Let's just go through the door and see what the fuck's here. Probably a boss. I highly doubt. I fucking highly doubt. You lose access to all your balcony and rest of the town. Surely I can backtrack later. And there's that dragon I can see about fighting as well, maybe. Now, in fact, now I killed Artorius, maybe that's triggered some change with the dragon situation? We'll get back there. Hopefully. Cutscene. Cutscene. Darkness. This is bad. This is bad. There's the hand. Oh my god. <laughs> there it was. The fucker that grabbed me through the portal. Oh. Hello, Mr. King of the Abyss. It's got feet, whatever it is. All oh, right, it's a walking, moving thing. Um, okay. Manus.
dude. Ain't fair. Fucking hell. You little ugly bastard. I've got no chaos fire. You miserable ugly shit. I wonder if he can cut his tail off. He does have a tail. Dude, you can't roll out of the way of that. Ow, fucker. Fucker, he got me. Right off the bat. Right, okay. Manus, father of the abyss. That's a pain. I couldn't, um, the, the, the rolling iframes didn't count for that slam attack. I'm pretty sure I was timing the slams well. Um. But okay, understood. <laughs> he slaps. At least now I'm gonna save my chaos fire. I reckon he might be weak to fire. Um. I might do what I said I was gonna do. Count my blessings. <laughs> And use this as a chance to uh, to loot all the town since I'm fucking here. Look, it's still loot right there, you see. Um, now that I don't think it's connected to this shit, so I'm gonna go down the elevator, the, this closest one here. Oh fuck me, I've got to I've got to run circles while waiting for the elevator. This is bad. I don't care about the souls. Right, that's not a one-shot kill, that's bad. Goodbye. <sighs> you know, it's funny. Manus just slapped me hard, but uh... I think I might be able to quite easily do him. As always, I was just paying attention to his attacks and shit. And this, yeah, I've learned the hard way. His slams go through your roll, so you can't really roll out of the way of that. I'm tempted to roll into his path, so he tries to, like, so he slams past me, basically. That makes sense? But other than that, only basic attacks so far. I'm wondering who Manus is, then. Right, the loot is pretty much up there on that balcony, so I reckon we need to go up inside here and find more doors and shit. Do you reckon I can run, not not jump, because I'll hit the fucking thing, but run onto that ledge there? Because if I don't, I'm dead. <laughs> if I hit the wall and just slide off like a basic bitch, I'm going to drop dead. So, this is a bit of a moment here. I just can't figure out how to get, like, to a couple of the places. Oh, I could! Oh my god, what a professional move, ladies and gentlemen. And by the way, that chest is not a chest, that's a monster. And you got fucked. Crest key. Oh, I haven't seen a key for a long time. Bent crest key. Bent crest key. The grooves of the crest are enchanted. The door... The grooves of the crest are enchanted. The door sealed with a powerful spell. Uh, crest key. Bent crest key. That is bent. The grooves of the crest are enchanted. The door seal, comma the door sealed with a powerful spell. I don't really know what that's referencing. Unless it's something right in front of me. Do you mind just chilling for a sec? Maybe there's a door right here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Anything here? Whip out the old light. 
Well, that's what goes down to the casty boy. Oh my god, the camera. Uh, well, okay, if I can climb down the ladder, surely I can climb back up it. So let's do that. Hello. Ah, oh, Falker, Falker. Little bastard. I mean, is there anything here other than this fucker? There's no doors. It's a random ass rope. Hmm. Uh, well, I got the key. That seemed to be the main thing. I haven't seen any doors, like enchanted doors or anything. So I'm not really sure what to think about that. Let's jump down. Well, this is going somewhere. Hello. Well, there's some humanities. Is this what I could see from up top? I think it is. It's up there. Yes, it is. Right, I think we're done in the town then. I am curious about the key. I don't remember seeing any locked door. Hmm. Yeah. Don't remember any locked door. Well, let's go back up. We'll warp to, uh to the cellar and we'll fight Manus again. Probably a bad idea to, <laughs> to come straight into the lion's den of humanities. Ow, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Oh my god, this is bad. This is some bad shit right here. Right, get it to run right. And then it's off the edge and then it can't fire downwards, downhill, so I'm good. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. You can't aim down here. I trust that fact. You can't aim down here. Right, that loot that I saw was like basically off the edge, but now I can't see it. Hmm. I'll remember after this boss that there is more loot here. I want to be full health when I get in here. Um, can I keep this weapon and the shield? I'll... Try tossing some fireballs at his ass. Not asked about the shit that I dropped. I'm really not. Just a few souls, so let's not even worry about that. Hello, you little bastard. I'm doing some good fire damage, eh? Oh, he dodged that last one. You see, you can't roll out of the way of that one. You can roll past that sweeping, sw sweeping strike. I need to get close for this whip. Ooh, it is good damage, but at the same time, it leaves me very vulnerable. Fuck. No, bad. No, stop. Stop. Let go. No. No. Thanks for giving me the... Thanks for giving me time to breathe. I bet you can get a tail weapon off this guy. Fucking hell, that's high damage. Bad, bad, bad. Fucking hell, man. Whoa, he's going ape shit. He's going ape shit, ladies and gentlemen. Very cool design, as with all the other bosses. I like his red eyes. Oh, 
Ah, that was my bad, that one. And again, I'm timing this all wrong. This is my fault. I'm suck assing. Getting better though. I like to think. Oh, fuck. I wonder if I can ret uh, return that with the uh, pendant. I do want to heal. Oh no, he's got me. Fucker! Well, I got him down to half health just with fucking pyromancy alone, so I'm quite happy with that. I'm happy with that. I reckon a good, ca a good, well-placed chaos storm, if he gives me time to breathe, will really fuck him up as well. Um, I can warp down that counter. Okay. Okay, we're doing good. That which I can't tell which of his attacks is the one that grabs you. Um, now that I reckon I could probably deflect that all that black shit he threw at me. Ooh. Let's not take any fall damage. Let's be a consummate professional here. There you go. That's how you do that. At least it's a nice, easy run back compared to some fucking bosses. I might have to replace the poison ring though, because that's... Why do I have that equipped? I need stamina, actually, more than anything. After this next death. Bad. Fucking hell. Right, let's try Chaos Storm. I want to see how easy it is to pull it off. I do need to heal, though. <laughs> Let's go close. Close seems to be better, really. Bad. Ooh, was that the grab attack just there? Ooh, fucking hell, he does go ape shit. Oh, his chain attacks are mental, man. Bad. Ew! Damn it. Bad. <laughs> He's got some delayed attacks here. You see, it's not worth it. It's not worth doing the Chaos Storm. Fireball, yes. Chaos Storm, no. Ow. Fucking hell, these chain attacks are... Cr Tyson would be proud of this fucker. Jesus. That's Mike Tyson. Can I fall off this? I haven't seen if there's like a proper edge to this arena. My roll was perfect then. That was perfectly timed. Hmm, some rolls are a bit weird. Fucker! No, he's, I'm dead. I'm dead. Hey, goodbye, life. Right, let's change my ring. Fucker. I'm gonna. I'm gonna fuck this guy up. Uchi Katana. That's a katana I don't have. 
Right, that's, uh, that is utterly useless. Poised as fuck all. Critical attack doesn't mean shit. Um, what really will help? The stamina can only help. The, the the ring of RFP or whatever the fuck it is obviously helps, but I'll not be able to take that off. Um, don't have any... F I mean, physical attacks? Um, it gives me a little extra physical, but I think I prefer stamina recovery, honestly. And b the, the serpent ring doesn't help boss loot, I've learned, so that's literally pointless to have on. Um... Uh, da, 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 da. I mean, nothing. Again, I'll I'll go with physical and stamina recovery. I think that's probably a good mix. I'll stick with the fiery sword because um, I didn't even use it yet. I think it is worth getting the fireballs off because he is quite slow. You know. I've got this. I believe in myself. Okay. So far, I've, I've faced every challenge, and I've overcome every challenge. I can't think of what I've found to be the most challenging boss yet. Um, honest, honest to God above, I think the bell gargoyles at the start of the game were my toughest... <sighs> ...were my toughest enemies yet, just because there are two of them, and when I first tried fighting them, I had no upgraded weapons and I was just getting hammered. But honestly, I think those are my toughest enemies so far in the game. Um, unless my mind has gone blank and I'm forgetting an obvious one. See, the scalers wasn't too bad. Gravelord Nito wasn't bad once I figured it out. Right. Um, you know what? I will actually just try sword attacks this time. Because it's much faster than trying to pull off a fireball. Oh, it does fuck all to him. That is fuck all damage. Oh, he got me with the combo. You can't- once he's- right. Once he's got you in the combo attack, that's it. He hits you like five times. Fuck. Look at that attack, man. <laughs> Forker. Oh my god, that's... Even when you're behind him, that's... The, the, the first attack of the combo attack reaches behind him. So it grabs you even when you're behind him and then you're just in the full combo attack. Still want to keep getting some sword attacks on them. See how good they are. Very weak, unless he's just resistant to slash. So far, my pyromancy is the best way to go. That's it. Oh, fuck me! Right, if any single attack in the combo hits you, then you are locked in for the rest of the combo. I see. So you can't get hit by a single combo attack. Oh, fuck. Bad. Bad. <gasps> Fucking hell, that's a long range, isn't it? That was some long-range shit, man. I rolled into that and got hit. The, the, the iframes seem to not work a lot of the time with certain boss attacks. Like, it just, it just hits you directly through the roll. I'm wondering if I should take off the shield as well, because I'm, I'm finding that I'm rolling through most of this. Let's do that. 
I'm not resorting to the shield at all this fight. My bad, my bad. <laughs> This is just practicing with the sword, that's all this one is. Should, should I just try and straight up? Hmm, you see the roll was perfect then. Three, four. That's the combo attack right there. It's a four or a five combo. For the pyromancy at least, I think range, getting quite far away from him is better. So I can't get hit with that fucking combo attack. Bad! That was my fault. Ooh, it was my fault. Oh god. Fucking hell, what length of arm has he got, man? Watch out, no, no, ooh! Why not retrieve my zero things, eh? Fuck! I just hit- I just tanked one of his hits, and I didn't get stumbled? Which is crazy. I don't even have the poise ring on anymore. I don't like being this close to him. Damn it, combo. <laughs> My physical defense ring seems to be helping a significant amount, though, to be fair. Right. Once he does that combo, you just gotta fuck right off, and then he's useless. <laughs> fuck off, would you? Okay. The first time I saw him do that, I thought it all came from one direction. No, that was around me. Okay. If I see him pop the purple shit, I'll hit down and square. And I reckon that might protect me. I think it will. Right, this sword is literally used. I'm getting the same problem I had against Artorias. My weapons seem to be fucking weak. At least that is. So... Black Knight, maybe? I kind of want some fucking... Speed, though. I'm tempted to whip out the lightning thing, honestly. Or maybe the Divine Club? I don't know if, like, Divine is strong against this shadowy abyss shit. Is that worth a try? I don't want to take, take that out and then just do shit damage with it. I'm gonna try the lightning spear. God help me. It worked against Artorius just because it's fast. Pokey attacks are fast enough. Whew. This is a toughie. I can take most of his hits, especially with this physical protection ring, but his combo attack is fucking brutal. You get hit by one of its attacks, you are locked in to get hit by every single hit in the attack, and there's five hits total, not four. So you need to be close range, but at the same time, not get hit by a single fucking one. 
I that was my bad. Oh, okay. That's one flask I've lost. <laughs> Fuck! Oh, that's two flasks I've lost. Jesus Christ. Oh, it's all going to shit. How long have I been going? Two and a half hours. I can do this, surely, in the next hour and a half. Because that's how long I've got. It'll be a shame if I can't do it this episode. Um, I'm going to just try the lightning spear this time. And if, if that's shit, then I don't know what to do. It's more damage than the um, fire sword by like 20. That's the combo. Oh no, it's not. You see, the jumping attack is quite high, actually. It's not that bad. 150 damage is not bad for a boss. He only does that attack when you're far away, have you noticed? Ow, oh, that's the... Right, okay. I think I recognised it. He did, like, a raw uh, thing before the combo attack, then. I missed. <laughs> oh. Maybe he does that sweeping attack close as well. Ugly bastard. Has he even got a face? There, combo. You're right. Got it. Understood. Right. Right. I think I've got this now. Sort of. Kind of. Fuck. Right, when he does the roar, I just need to roll backwards rather than into him. Okay, let's start getting some serious pokes on him. Oh, I hit him in the face. <laughs> no combo attack for you, motherfucker. No! Oh, you fucker. I thought I was far enough away to fireball him. You little fuck. You cheeky fuck. Want to heal. What? Oh, dude, I'm getting, uh, constantly surprised how long-range his attacks are. <sighs> you know what, I think I have just been timing them wrong. Yeah, I think I've just been timing the rolls wrong. You ain't shit. I'm just gonna poke you for days. Sorry if you can hear that loud car outside my house. Just revving his engine for no reason. Ow. Oh, there's a big long delay after that f slam attack. Got him. <laughs> you know what, I might as well do my f my f pyromancies, because... They 
how high damage like. Damn it. <laughs> he got me with the combo. You fucker. Attack me, you fool. I need plenty of time to, uh, to heal. There you go. Come at me, bruh. Ow! Oh, he kneed me in the face, and it, it pushed me backwards so I couldn't dodge. Oh, right, okay. Interesting. So he can knee me in the face before he does that slam. This is bad. Bad! My fault. Yeah. Eee. No! I'm not getting combo today, sir. That was my fault. You see, these, these hits are just my fault. I can't even see because of the fucking pillar, man. Bad. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Say it ain't so. No. Ooh, uh, worth it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Worth it. No! Fuck! I hate that combo attack! Fuck! Hey, my pyromancers are fucking high damage. They shit on weapon damage. I did hit him once. Ow. Double ow, I'm an idiot. I'm failing this. It's all my fault. No combo attack for you, sir. Oh! Oh! That's a new one. He tail whipped me. Oh, for fuck's sake, now I'm getting slapped. The amount of times I need to heal is crazy. I'm just learning the- shit. <laughs> I'm just learning the attacks, that's my excuse. Well, it worked, ladies and gentlemen, but fucking hell. It, it made me vulnerable to his follow-up. Am I dead? Ah, oh, right, okay. It worked, but it made me super vulnerable to his follow-ups. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay, here's the game plan going forward. Um... I'm gonna... Uh, I'm tempted to put on the Black Knight Sword and just see if that's just better to straight damage. It might be too slow, but I guess we'll see. He is quite slow to recover sometimes, so it might work brilliantly. Um, mm. I don't need the lantern on. As nice as the lantern is sometimes. Uh, yeah, the physical protection is definitely helping. The stamina is helping, just for the rolling. Um, but I'm tempted to replace one of them with, uh, the, the ha Havel's ring and see if I can get light rolling. Probably not, but, you know. 
But I'm glad to see uh, that pendant works against his big old attack. Okay, so here's the game plan. Hopefully this sword does a bit more damage per hit, but I'm going to open with all my pyromancers because it just it us out damages everything else. Maybe not the Chaos Storm because that's a very slow attack and it's too slow. Oh, right. oh my god, he opens up with the cat. He opens with the combo attack. Are you kidding me? Fucker. It seems, though, that his combo attack does less than half my health in damage, though. So as long as I'm over half health, I can survive the full combo attack. Right. Once he does that slam attack, I've got enough time to do a pyro. There you go. How did that not hit him? The fuck? He does have a face, but it, it, his horns look like they come out of his eyes, sort of. Calm down, would you? There's no need to be so angry, Mr. Manus, father of the Abyss. Ow. Oh, I don't have half health. I need to heal. Ow. Right, I, I'm keep, I keep getting kneed by that charging attack. And it fucks me because I can't roll afterwards. Fuck. That is brutal. I can't believe that I didn't hit him. God, I'm failing this. Christ. No! <laughs> this guy's getting tougher, man. Jesus Christ. This guy's are just annoying. <laughs> Fuck, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, dead. Game over. I'm rage quitting. <laughs> you bastard. Right, should we try getting some uh, Black Knight attacks in? Why am I fucking... Why have I got the shield out? I'm not even using it. What? 
I dodged that. Oh, that's good damage, is that? Oh, Black Knight Sword is going to win me this fight. Oh, fuck yes. Tell me I'm not a fucking legend. <laughs> you suck, bitch. You ain't nothing. I wipe my balls with you. Okay, there are two different attacks. I see. Oh god, bad. Uh, there are two different shadowy attacks. Fuck off, would you? Oh, this guy's annoying. Come on, I thought I was far enough away. Oh, this guy is so fucking shit. I mean, he's not, he's good. But he's annoyingly good. I mean, I had to have the fucking thing go into dodge, you know what I mean? And then he's a fucking attacking me. It sucks being against the fucking boundary. Christ. Ooh, his arm gets, like, stuck in the floor. Fuck off, man! You know, he's not kneeing me in the face to stumble me there. He's, like, slamming his cock in my face. He's, he's cock-slapping me. And it's not cool. Dude. I, I can't even switch to that item to use it in time. I'm out of fucking shit now. Let's just go for it. It's pretty much game over. Ow. Oh, I miss. He missed. Right, okay, that, that attack comes in multiple stages, have you noticed, by the way? Fuck off with your cock slap. No more cock slaps. I completely got the timing of that wrong. No, I'm too f oh. Damn it. My health is uh is bad, man. <laughs> he had no health rem at, at those those purple abyss attacks uh, they're reflectable but f they're they're awkward he's got like three different abyss attacks one of them comes from the front and it's and it happens too fast to use this item uh the other one comes from all around you, but it comes at you in multiple phases. Do you notice? I had to use it once, and it blocked some of them, and then more came in, and I used it ag again, and it blocked some, but then one last one then came in. There's like three waves of it. Right, okay. Game plan is, is more refined now. I'm going to have this pendant on by default. I know, that's crazy, but I can always hold my down button to get my flasks back on. I'm sort of all, almost comfortable enough now to not get hit by any attack. I've just got to be extra watchful with that combo shit. 
Uh, this and also part of the game plan is um. By the way, this is gonna, I mean, I'm going on three hours now. It, it did take pretty much the length of an episode, so I think I might have him. I think I might have him. Um, but my game plan is not to use any pyromancy. The sword is high enough damage by far, so I'm just going to uh, two-hand the, the Black Knight sword, and I've got him. And I'm going to get close range as well. This, this sword is once again proving how fucking strong it is. And then the second slam. I can get one running attack after he does that combo attack. You suck, dude. I think the key is to walk backwards a bit before I start dodging that combo attack. Oh, he got me there. He's sometimes his, his follow-up attacks are a bit too fast. I do need to heal once, and then I'll get that thing back out. There you go. Fucking perfect. Fucking perfect. No! Fucking perfect. Fucking perfect. <laughs> go away with your cock charges. You see? Oh no, he just- he j that was unlucky. He just caught me there. That was very unlucky. Do a long range attack please. Thank you. Works pretty well. Come back here. I did take a bit of damage there. I think I was too long getting that ready. I want to heal to full, I'll be honest. If he gives me a free hit, though, I'll get that. Couldn't do shit against that one. Fuck, bad, 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 much bad. Fucker. Right, come on then, fine, I'll just do raw damage to you, I don't care. Oh, come on! I was far enough for that combo attack! Dude, you are full of shit. Oh, bad. Right, let's heal to full. Fuck me. And he's, let's just take my time, but let's ultimately heal to full. There. Right, now I can focus on attacks. Sort of. It's just a few basic sword attacks, that's all it is. My bad. Fuck! Bad! No, shit. Fuck! Fucking, fucking, fucking shit! Just a fish of fuck! I keep doing this thing where I'm not expecting to have the pendant on. 
I, I, I act like I've got the flask on, so I press down once to switch to the pendant. But because I already had it on, I'm switching to some random fucking item instead. So that I'm, I'm stood there without the pendant available, you know? Definitely default to the pendant and don't press fucking down. Just use it. I'll only switch to health to heal. Otherwise, I just need to get more hits in and I'm good, basically. Easy. Easy mode. Yep, no problem. Everything so far hasn't been me sucking. I've just been um, doing little, what you call, like, probing attacks. Sending just scout parties into his defenses. Just, just to, you know, just as a little probes. Just to see what he's made of. See what he can do. I might as well just straight up, no bullshit, take the shield off. It's just a waste of fucking weight at this point. Maybe the rolling might be a tiny bit faster. I've fucking got this. In fact, I don't even, it doesn't take a weight, but I can take off the pyromancy. I really don't even need it. Come on. Come on. I ain't scared of you. You ain't shit. I want him to destroy these rocks if possible. Bad, bad. I couldn't get away from that one. That's my fault. 100%. You missed, fucker. And then the second slam. And then I'll run for a hit. He recovers from that faster than you think he's gonna. Who are you running away from, motherfucker? I might want to wait for him to attack me, honestly. Rolling away from that that cock slam is definitely the move. Fucking hell, cock slammed like a professional. He's a professional cock slammer. Oh bad, this is bad. What am I doing? What am I doing? shield. At least I can survive that one. You, you know what I mean? At least I can survive the, uh, the, the frontal abyss attack. Just not the other one. Easy, motherfucker. Easy, motherfucker! Oh, cock slam! I wonder if my neighbours can hear what I'm saying. <laughs> Talking about cock slams. I don't want to be this close in case he does that fucking um, combo attack. That was good. Mucho goodo. You suck, dude. You ain't shit. You suck. You still suck. I'm the lord of the universe. You ain't a fucking thing to me. I wipe my balls with your abyssal moves. 
<laughs> My bad. My bad. I'm too close to the edge here. I'm too close to the edge. I couldn't get away from it. Fuck. Fucking edge. You know, that that attack is actually delayed if I just Oh that's bad, that's bad, yeah. You can't roll fast enough. Um <laughs> there you go. That one's just delayed. As long as you don't do that thing immediately, or do it twice, you're fine. I love this pendant! Look at that! I don't know why I'm rolling away. And what an amazing boss, made more amazing by the pendant, Soul of Manus. Oh, that was a 10 humanity. Nice. Any souls? Hello. Is this Manus in human form? Uh, I'm going to talk. I'm worried look, going on the bonfire will get rid of this person. They'll just vanish. So let's talk first. <laughs> Hello? Priestess? Sorry? Of course, yeah. We're rescuing the priestess. Um... Do I have to use...? <laughs> no, okay. Maybe I have to go to use the soul of Manus? Let's rest. It's maybe she'll wake up or something, I don't know. Please don't, please don't disappear or do something shit. Right, okay. 60,000, I'll level up with that, actually. Um. Let's go, I love the damage of the Black Knight Sword. Let's just stay true hybrid this playthrough, 50-50. The Black Knight Sword saved me in that fight. Right, I can't do anything, so... What's the dealio? Wake up. <laughs> Surely that soul of Manus is needed for a boss weapon. In fact, I remember that it is. I remember seeing Manus on the list of boss weapons, so I I'm not going to use that like that's going to do something. Um... Let's read it anyway. Soul of Manus, Father of the Abyss. This extraordinary soul is a viscous, lukewarm lump of gentle humanity. Ancient Manus was clearly once human, but he became the father of the Abyss after his humanity went wild, eternally seeking his precious broken pendant. And that's what I have. That's what let me get to the Abyss. Oh. We got the broken pendant in the future, in our time. I wonder if it's... I mean, I suppose enough time passes, it is the same world, so it would be in our world. Uh, so, it did, that, that, somebody said that the Abyss was created because somebody, some humanity, some human, Manus, fucked up some grave of something and it created the Abyss. Um, can I use the broken pendant then? Or did I use, I think I used the broken pendant, didn't I, to start this whole shit. Yeah, I did. I mean... I mean... Uh... You can warp back to most boss rooms. I'm guessing if we warp away... 
I don't have any... Right, okay, let's look at this logically. I don't have any items I can use. Pendant doesn't work. I can't talk to her. Light doesn't work. Resting doesn't work. I don't think I've got anything else. So let's warp back to the mushroom lady. And then we'll warp back maybe and see if there's a change. Because this is the priestess we're supposed to be rescuing, so... So what's the dealio? She isn't magically here, is she? I have awaited thee. Oh, right, okay. Thou hast rescued Princess Dusk. Just like that. And rid us of that terrible primeval human. Even halting the spread of the abyss. I salute the grandeur of thine enterprise. Please allow me to express my gratitude. I thank thee, as do we all. Thank you for your kind words. Oh, you gave me three of your little mushroom things. I will remember hmm. thee, but I will keep thy story to myself. Oh, no, 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 no. tell the this world. Is the best way, for thou art come from a time far ahead. No one will sing thy praises. Good point. But yet thy greatness shall live on. That might confuse everyone. It be my purpose to remember all thou hast done for us. I might go talk to um, Masked Stranger Boy. <laughs> was thine right, Okay. <laughs> now, I mean, she was, um... It's faster to go... May the flames... Um, to get to Masked Boy is a hell of a run, or... Um, town is close-ish. I'll go to the town one. Township is in front of me. Chasm of the Abyss, that's it. Now, she just said I rescued her, so I think officially I've rescued her. I didn't have to do anything. But she's not going to be here still, is she? No, okay. Well, in that case, let's go and find her somewhere. Before we end the episode. Um, I'm going to end it now. Even if I were to one-shot kill the final boss, it, you know, it, it'll take time. There's lots of extras I want to do. Red Dragon. Um... 2.0 fight I want to do. I want to kill the red dragon. Um, Onion head and his little line. And there's there's more stuff I would want to do. So I'm going to save that for one final episode. And then I'll end that with the main boss. Um, so we'll, we're finishing this episode basically now. But I do want to try and find the princess. Um, right, okay. There was a little jump cut there. I just uh, taken a three minute break. My thoughts on that fight. Let's just sum up the fight. I thought that was a fantastic fight. Please don't mistake my, um, me saying, oh, that's bullshit, etc., as me complaining about the fight. It's That's just me complaining that I'm stupid and I got hit by attacks. <laughs> that's, that's complaining at myself. The fight was awesome. That was one of those fights where once you learned the attacks and so on, I just felt all powerful. Before I had even killed him, I just thought, right, I've got this, and it felt great. So that was, um, I very much enjoyed that fight. I can see, I can see why people um, are singing praises for the DLC, because Artorius, the fight was definitely one of the best in this game, and this Manus fight, I personally enjoyed. Um, I'd go so far as to say both Artorius and Manus are definitely top five boss fights in this game for me. If not, like, top three or four. I really enjoyed both of them. Um, now, there's there's still the question of that dragon, so that's what we're going to check next. After we try and find what's-a-face. Um, let's go to every bonfire, and failing that, we'll... Uh... Failing that, we'll then go to Masked Stranger, and then... Check dragon area. Maybe she's wandering around somewhere. Uh, she's not here. She know this. She might be at the sanctuary once I've reloaded and shit. Let's go back to the town, and I'm gonna check behind us in Artorias's little arena and shit. She might be knocking about somewhere. She's gotta be somewhere. She might be, um, in the garden in present time. Well, she's not here, but let's go talk to Stranger. And then I suppose we should, um... I suppose we should just go down to Dragonland? Maybe something's changed? 
you know? Is he still gonna call me thick after I've just been killing tough motherfuckers? Oh, you. You have quite some nerve. Or are you just thick? Fine then. What is it that you need? Go fuck yourself, sir. Well, I've... Uh, I'm not I've tempted seen... to kill you if, if you if weren't, you... sir. If you weren't so hilarious, I'd probably kill you where you stand, sir. I've got fuck all to lose now, like fuck all. I'm not human. I've got no humanity. Shall I just go quickly check out... Dragonland? See if there is vaguely any change or difference. I mean, something new might be down there or happen. I remember a comment last episode did say there is a way of cheesing him. I'm, I think there must be a way of actually fighting him, but then I think there is also a cheese tactic, like with shooting him with arrows or something. You see, this, this sword has limitations. Jesus Christ. Oh, if I time the running attack, well. I've got this. Bring it on. You ain't shit. I'll try and get the chest at some point as well. What time are we on? Three hours. I suppose, you know, I suppose technically I've still got like 40 minutes. Or something like that. Um, to get to the typical four hour mark, you know. I could just keep going, I guess. Right, there is no change here. That crystal fucking lizard is still there. Oh, fucker. <laughs> right, okay. Well, I've committed now. Um, I've committed now. I mean, Christ. If I just get auto-killed again, then I'll, I'll try talking to some people, doing some shit. Is that just a flower on the wall over there? He hasn't attacked me yet, by the way. Best be prepared, hey? For a dragon boy. In fact, let's be really prepared. Put the fire shield on. He has not attacked me yet. I don't know if it's because I haven't gone in that direction much, because last time when I came down here, there was a big delay with his attack, but he hasn't come at me yet. I've got nothing to lose, let's just run around. A death, instant death. Yes. Okay, okay. Alright. Um. Okay. For a second there, I actually thought he was coming into land and fight proper. Did you, did you notice? He, there was a big delay then compared to all the previous breath attacks. He proper flew central into the area then. Well, I'm gonna go speak to, um, Mushroom one more time. I'd like to find the princess. Maybe she's here now. I've had some loading screens and shit. Um, there's got to be something I can do with the dragon. There's no way you can't fight him. There, there must be a way of bringing him down or weakening him so you're fighting proper rather than just getting auto-killed. Struggling, are Oh. If there's anything I can do. <laughs> no, I forgot to say. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, there's there's Mushroom Lady here, there's Masked Stranger, who, who's... Neither of them have any new info for me. There's no other NPCs in this area, is there? Like, zero? There was the lady who came along, but she disappeared after giving me the two weapons. Um... I don't know what to do about the dragon. Oh, hang on, did I see something this then? Hello? I saw a little bit of blue. Hello! Oh, okay. Like I need that. 
I'll just do a once over this whole area. Well, um, what's her face isn't here and she's not even in the thing anymore. Shall I try checking out the foot of the garden or Firelink Shrine or something? I'm kind of worried that when I leave the DLC place that all sorts of shit is going to change, you know, like, um, let's just try going to Firelink. She might be there. I'm, I mean... She was originally in our time, wasn't she? Our world, so... Is she going to come back to our world? Or is she going to stay in the past? Um, I mean... I assume she would be somewhere obvious, so I guess she isn't here. He's just sleeping, living his best life. I'm not going to wake him up, him up just yet. Y you come next episode, Mr. Snake. Um, well, I might have to jump cut here and just, uh, I want to go down into the abyss, uh, the, abyss, the um, garden and see if she's where she was originally. And if she, if I do find her and she's got nothing new to add, then I don't know how we're going to face that dragon. Clearly, there's got to be some way to trigger it coming down and not breathing on you. Unless I've missed my opportunity, maybe I needed to do something before I uh, killed Artorius or Manus. Maybe I've fucked it now permanently. Oh! Uh. She, right, okay, she did mention a summon sign. Is this it? This was not here before. Right, I need to kill these fuckers. Um. Have you seen how powerful I am now? <laughs> and then I go and spoil it all by doing something stupid like fireballing a rock. You ain't shit, sir. I'm not even flinching. Okay. I wonder if I can actually straight... I mean, what's the point of this after you do the DLC? Let's, let's do it. Oh, it's gone. Oh. She's here. Was that, Right, was this the, the way officially to talk to her again? I am Dusk of Ulysio. I know. It is an honor to see oh. thee again. I shall follow thine wishes. Ooh. Right, I don't know if you could do this before all that shit went down, or if it's just now. But hey. If thou art in need, pray summon me again. Oh, I shall. May the flames... Oh, I shall indeed. That's the wrong, that's not what I meant to do. I rescued you. You're welcome. I don't know why I'm bowing to you. You should bow to me. I've I saved the world. It. It isn't, I sh so she got like spells and shit. Invisibility, invisible weapon repair. She got a nice little catalyst. Okay. For a very long time, I was trapped within the crystal golem. Mm. From my home, I was taken and banished to a plane of distortion. It was there that thou came to my rescue. Long after I had relinquished all hope, so gleeful was I. My faith reneweth. Th th those aren't her ears, those are little wing things. She just had normal ears as well. The sorceries of Ulysseo differ from the magic of thine age. It is difficult to explain. They're a lot more purple. Ulysseo's sorceries are, what doth one say? <laughs> They're somewhat of an approximation. Thine uh sorceries are... More straightforward, negating all but thyself. Dost thou not find some fascination in these discrepancies? <laughs> Why are all the voices in all the FromSoft games that I've played so far all really soft-spoken people? All of them? The sorceries of Ulysseo 
differ from the ah, okay. Well, it's nice to talk to you again. I'm, I'm glad you're okay. Pray some of me. All good. Oh shit. Well, there's there's nothing else to do now. I am. Um... Well, I think we might be good. I'll be honest, I was expecting her to return to the sanctuary, you know? God, I can't see the edge here, right there. It is. I just want to see if the portal is there again. Otherwise, I shall home bone my way back. Surely that isn't the main place you've, you've got to speak to her. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Uh, this was not here, was it? Little bonus thing I find it very strange she isn't just like after you've completed the DLC she's not at Firelink Shrine or back at the Sanctuary she's, you've got to come here and summon her again ooh oh what that's her clothes and that's her little wing thing on her head what what was this is her dead what Was that a spirit of her or something? Right, somebody might have to let me know here, because this is like untold story that I'm not getting. This is her dead. This is her body, and like, is this like the real her, and that's her remaining spirit or some, some shit? There's some discrepancy, as she puts it here. She's dead, but she's alive. Maybe that is her past self, who I am summoning here to talk to. And so she's... So she's alive in the past or whatever, but this is her future self and she's died or died of old age or something. Otherwise, I'm a bit confused there. Let's give the wing thing a little read. Crown of Dusk. Special magic crown bestowed upon Dusk Princess of Ulysseel upon her birth. Its wearer is blessed by all manner of magic. This raises the power and effect of magic, but damage suffered by magic also rises. The fire rises. Well, the smoke rises. Uh, muy interessant. Okay. So that's a great for a magic build, but a very offensive one. Okay. Let's bone my way home. Okay. Um... We're pretty much done here. I, I do want to do a big old once-over, I'll be honest, of fucking loud cars outside my house. I'm glad you can't hear all of them because I've got fantastic noise suppression on this mic, but Jesus Christ, I've got like boy racer arseholes who live around me and they're, they're constantly fucking revving their engines and being dicks. I'm trying to record a Dark Souls episode here. Um, anyway, yeah, what was I saying? I, uh, I do want to do a once-over because clearly there's some shit to do with the dragon there. Ain't no way the game gives you a fucking dragon and you can't kill the, the, fuck, or the fucking dragon without some cheese tactic. There must be a way of fighting it proper. So... I'm going to go to every single bonfire in this place and, uh... This might be one of those cases. I'm free to roam around now, so I'm not locked in one place. So, uh, between episodes, I'm free to roam around. Before next episode, recording everything, as always, just in case something happens, um, I might just literally blitz the entire DLC area, see if I've missed any items. Um, yeah, I always record just in case something happens, like an NPC appears or whatever. Um... But there's like somebody mentioned a chest in the garden, little things that I may have, may have missed, um, and I want to find if there's something new, you know. I think I pretty much aced. Uh, I aced most of, most if not all of the town, and I, I think I aced the cave. Although there was that item I saw very far down, which was curious. Struggle if. <laughs> oh, she's got nothing new for me. I'm not going to run around the entire garden now. I'm going to end the episode, I think, if there's nothing on the next fire. I'm actually surprised. 
although I don't know why, that no one is saying anything about the dragon. I think we're good for now, but uh, try and let me know, spoiler free, if there's some shit with the dragon that I can do. Like some, some, some obvious shit, like somewhere I can go or, you know what I mean? Let's go up here. I, I don't know why. Let's just see if there's something new. Or at least look upon the land and call it the end of the episode. Da, da, da. This is just a PvP area. Um. Well. Well, 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 and, and what's all that cat shit? What was going on with the cat illusions down in the fucking cave? There's definitely something I've missed. Um, but you know what? We're going to end the episode right here. Um, looking out at the land, sort of. Well, thanks for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that crazy boss fight and com completing the town. As I said, let me know if I've missed anything major or like try and give me spoiler free hints as to what I might want to do if there is something you can do about that dragon. Clearly, there's got to be something. Um, you guys know, you know what I'm saying. No major spoilers, but uh, is there something I've got to talk to? Or do I have to fight the dragon as is, but there's a way to stop him breathing? by going down there, doing something, maybe. I don't know. Maybe you've got to just survive a, f a few breaths and then he'll land. Because once he lands, that's it, it's game on. But uh, it's not game on while he's still flying around and breathing on me. So let me know. Hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. This was probably one of the best episodes, or a couple of episodes yet. I really, really enjoyed this DLC. And we haven't even finished it yet, really, technically. <laughs> Like this video if you liked it, like this video if you didn't like it, and subscribe for similar games and content. All my social media links in the description, and I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my playing of these games. I need to buy <laughs> Dark Souls 2 and 3, so <laughs> Patreon funds will be going on that, believe me. I hope they're not too expensive. Anyway, yeah. Let me know if you've got any feedback or uh, answers to my questions, and uh, I'll catch you next time for what could and probably is going to be the final episode. Even if that dragon fight is like a big deal, I'll probably still have two or three hours left still to then finish the game and do other shit, so I reckon the last one is going to be the final episode. Or the second to last. Catch you next time. Liquid Blitz, out. Out.